which is regarding a recent dream in Proverbs 13, 22 B. The wealth of the wicked is stored up for the righteous. Hear ye the word of the Lord. Proverbs 28, 8. When one gets rich, misusing the poor and needy, all the wealth they gather will one day be given to those who are kind and generous to the innocent, the weak, the poor, and the needy. Psalm 25, 12 and 13. What man is there who fears Yahweh? Yahweh shall instruct him in the way that he shall choose. Then prosperity and favor will be their portion, and their children will inherit all that is good in the land. Note, the fear of Yahweh is to hate evil. Proverbs 8.13 Psalm 97.10, you who love Yahweh, hate evil! Yes. He preserves the lives of his set apart. He delivers them out of the hand of the wicked. Now, here's an example. In Matthew 4, 8 through 10, the devil took Yeshua to a very high mountain, yes. and he showed him all the kingdoms of the world and their glory. And Satan said to him, I'll give you all these things if you'll fall down and worship me. Then Yeshua said to him, Get behind me, Satan, for it is written, You shall worship Yahweh your Almighty and serve him only. Yes. 3 John 1, 2 Beloved friends, I pray above all things that you prosper, succeed in business affairs in every way and that you be in good health just as your soul prospers it goes forward led by a direct and easy way i'll comment on some of these in a moment but i want to yes. read them first me too so i believe king yeshua desires righteous men and women to be raised up in this hour raised up with divine wisdom, revelation, and understanding, led by Holy Spirit, yes. raised up together with Him with the spiritual gift of helps to bring many new businesses into being. And I think you're one of them. Amen. And people to manage righteous businesses that will honor Father Yahweh and be a blessing to him and his people. An example, just two. Hall Ag and Seven Seals Company, a company of my son, serving Penny Newman grains in Stockton, California, and Fresno. Robert is in charge of that. He's the he, he, he takes care of the book, all the book, book the books of uh, uh, Penny Newman, but also others, which is a fulfillment of a uh, prophecy he gave to me about Robert through Charles Capps years ago in the 80s. So here's the examples. Hall Ag and Seven Seals Company and other businesses and many others to be raised up but what he wants to do is raise up righteous men and women yes and it will be in the last day says yahweh almighty i will pour out my spirit on all flesh your sons and daughters will prophesy your young men will see visions your old men will dream dreams and i think what he's saying to me here is saying these young men, this generation and yes. the, the generation after this are the young men he's, he's talking about. He said they're going to get visions. To visions mean you're going to see things. That vision is seeing, isn't it? So you're it's going to see and things. Peter and Jeff. <laughs> so you're going to see things 
an old man? Thank you, Lord. He didn't leave us out, brother. That's right. He didn't leave us out. He didn't leave us out. <laughs> and he said, these older men, yes. instead of saying they're going to retire and give up and go to heaven, no, we've got work to do. Yeah, the old men are going to dream dreams, That's hallelujah. Right. That's right. And in those dreams, he's going to show you things. That's right. And so while this word is happening, and it's being fulfilled, the wicked shall be stripped. Hear me now. I'm talking to the devil every once in a while. Yes. The wicked shall be stripped of their fortunes that were used for demonic purposes, influenced by Satan to rob, kill, and destroy Yahweh's children who belong to him. Jeremiah 1.10 The whippet the wicked are being stripped of their fortunes. That's right. They've been using it. I could say names. I guess I could if I want to. You know, I'm a free man. That's right. But I hear a lot of multi-billionaires and multi-millionaires. And they're using their money against us and against the people. That's right. giving money to the wicked. Planned Parenthood and go on and on and on and on and on. Yes. they got to go. They're going to get stripped of their fortunes. You watch. Mm -hmm. uh, men like uh, Obama. Yes. Biden. Who took the to he took the fortunes of this people of this nation and gave it to the devil's people That's right. to get weapons and to, and come against not only Israel but us too. Us too. And they're set out to ruin us. But I got news: we're going to cut them down in the name of the Lord. Obama sends three plane loads full of money on pallets, billions and billions of money to Iran. And this is what the Lord is fed up with. He's watching this. And he said, they're going to be stripped. And their fortune, they're going to wind up. And what's that other guy? The George Soros. Yeah, George Soros. And uh, the, uh, the guy that does all the computer stuff. Bill Gates. Bill, Bill Gates. Gates. Yes. I, I, that's just a few names I'm talking about. No telling how many more. The other evil guy is uh, BlackRock. Uh... Um, they're funding the devil's yes, work. They yes, they are. But they're going to be stripped, and you and others are going to be raised up and take the fortunes and use it for the glory That's of the right. Almighty. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. They will be stripped of their fortunes that were used for demonic purposes, yes. influenced by Satan to rob, kill, and destroy. See? Donald, Earl, Brad, and anybody else, we've got brothers all over the earth he's probably saying the same thing to right now. Yes, yes. And I he, set you over. I set you over today. See? Look at this. I have today set you over wicked nations, kingdoms, and governments to uproot and tear them down. Uproot them and tear them down. That's right. To destroy and to overthrow them. Hear ye the word of the Lord. I said to overthrow them. Yes. Then, when that's taken care of, what do we do? Build and plant. We build and we plant and we establish. <laughs> a whole fresh new, uh, a whole fresh new change in the earth. Not just in this nation. I'm talking about the whole world right now. And I'm looking at just ours. Here I am rebuilding something at 83, 84 years old. And it's fresh. It's new. And clean. It has, and has, it has fresh men in it. It's clean. Brad's age. Yes. And, and they're, they're on fire yeah. to, to get all this done. Oh. How many men in that scripture did he use mightily that were in their 80s? Quite a few. There's a lot of them. Many, 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 yes. 
and they just got started. Moses, Joshua, Caleb. Joshua and Caleb. Moses too. Yeah. He didn't start. Moses? He never started till he was eighty. All of them. Yeah, that's what it says. That's right. And now after that, he got some more wives and had a bunch more babies at eighty something. Don't that's you right. guys yeah. put all, all this foolishness on us? We're we're strong in the Lord. Yes. And his mighty power. Amen. Yes. Amen. So here we go. Righteous and just Father, we ask you to raise up young men who will see visions, to establish and build good businesses, yes. and that your old men will receive dreams to help, to promote, to build, and protect businesses that will honor you. Bless your people. To you be the glory, the honor, the praise, and the worship forever. So just what I'm saying here, and I ain't messing around. All these evil billionaires and wicked doers are being stripped and, uh, for the, according to the word. They are going to be removed. Yes. Get out of here. Yeah. I, I've noticed there's young men that he's raising up already. Besides Trump, he, Trump's not 80 yet, but he's still... They think he's old, but he is he is called to help us in this change. Right, right, right. right. That's right. And, and he will be the most powerful man on earth. By the power and anointing of the Holy Spirit. That's right. The Lord told me, he said, that these are ones that he's found. He has found them to be worthy. Yeah. By their fruit. By the works. That's why he's choosing you. Yes. He's found you worthy of him, that he can trust you with fortunes because you're going to use it for the glory of Father. Father. You're going to use it for what he tells you to use That's it for. Right. That's right. And then I, I, I thought, I just heard about Elon Musk. He's been glorifying the Lord. Yes, he has. He's yes. been honoring the Lord. Mm -hmm. And I believe he's one of those two that is going to be replenishing the earth and restoring it like it's right. got to be. That's right. And, and he's backing Trump, and he's considered the richest man on the earth. Now, he's glorifying God. He's, he's backing Trump. He's standing up to these people. And... And 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 he's 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 helping the poor people and so on, and he's building other businesses. Uh, yes, hallelujah. Yes, and and he will use us also but to do the same thing, just like him. That's it's right. a gift. See, he did. He didn't. This is gifts from heaven. Yes, it is. This is gifts from the king yes. to accomplish what's in his heart. Yes. He wants things right now. That's right. That's he's fed true. up with what he's been seeing and hearing. Yes. And so now I believe he's raising up men like that, like us. But see, there's a lot of men, I believe, in, in our age and in, in your age, that they have some wisdom and education of learning. Experience. Experience, what kind of experience? Yeah. Experience. And, that, and we need that. Mm -hmm. And the young men are going to need that. Mm -hmm. See, mm -hmm. you can counsel them. You yeah. can right. encourage them, and you can strengthen them. Mm -hmm. And I believe that's what he's so, let me see, the glory of the Lord on you. And the glory means his presence. Yes. And so his presence is going to be on you in such a way that... I believe those who, who are around you or working with you are going to be those who also are going to be raised up. Can I just be bold and say, but we need some more Elon Musk's? Yeah. Of course. Right. Why not? Why not? Course, if he can give him that gift, if he can give you that gift and you that gift, how many more are there out there that he's going to raise up while the others fail? You're not going to hear about him. I don't know how he's going to do it. But I get a prophetic word, and I'll, 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 I'll say this, and then I'll, I think I'll let you. Uh, I, I, my son, when I, I called him, and I, I, I talked to him about it, he said, Dad, I'm, he, he said, uh, I, I'm in total agreement that that's yeah. from the Lord. Mm -hmm. You know, because he's out there, and he's doing that. You he's, know, he's, he's a businessman doing, yeah. 
his company, Seven Seals, and he's, and he's, he's in charge of all of the book, book work and bookkeeping and the, uh, uh, what is it, the, oh, what do you call it? He probably handles a lot of their uh, financial areas yeah. and, and he's probably yeah, is similar to a controller, uh, chief financial officer and and, and the word I'm looking for is he, he tells uh, how much is in the in the grain, how many grains is in the oh in the big bands yeah, yeah. In so the, big, the words uh, I forget what you call it now but anyway he, he has the measurements right the, it's, yeah. it's so so but in his heart he felt that it was it, it was from the Lord. And I remember in the 80s, we went to a meeting at uh, Charles Capps. And Charles Capps, he gave a vision, a, a, a prophetic word. There's all this water backed up like behind a dam. like a. Uh, and then all of a sudden, he said, these dams are going to be broke down and the water is going to gush out. And he said, what it's talking about is there's going to be... A, People in the body of Messiah are going to get so get wealth. Yes. For the purpose of the Lord. Yes. We walked our car, and Sharon and I looked, and she said, I said, sweetheart, uh, Robert's one of those. And she said, that's what he told me. Okay, so is this at such a time now? When this time when there's going to be something so quick and powerful? We're going to be astonished. I think that's, what, and here I think it's showed me it's astonished, but uh, I think Hall Ag went through some uh, uh, difficulties with the evildoers, right? Yes. yes. They, they got dealt with, didn't they? That's right. Okay, there's, that has to happen all across every right. business. That's right. There's going to be, I'm going to prophesy, there's going to be no more wicked businesses using their money to, 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 to put in that Democrat party. Right. And do what they're doing with all that bit m money? Yes. No, 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 no. So uh, I'll, I'll try to rest my case in just, <laughs> just a minute, but I'll rest it with this. Uh, after all those uh, billionaires, uh, when they found out that they were going to put uh, Kalama, or whatever his name is, it is uh, Harris, they all started pouring multi millions of dollars, 200 million. 300 million, all that. You're pouring it into an evil person. And we can't have that evil person running this country. And 